Hey y'all, Dominic here again, welcome to another video. I hope everyone's been doing well by the way, and I hope you're all having a nice weekend so far. So as you can see, I'm back after my short break from making videos, and overall, I feel a bit more positive, a little bit more happy, a little bit more upbeat. And I'm actually quite glad I took that, um, had that short break from making videos. Uh, obviously at the time, I just wasn't in the real, wasn't in the right mindset. And I just wanted to focus on myself and my family and other things, and I'm quite glad I did that. So, yeah. So, like I said, more positive, a little bit more upbeat. And, um, yeah, it's a good thing. It really, really is. So, yeah. <laughs> so, today I'm actually going to be talking about a funny story from many, many years ago. And when my mother was actually cutting my hair on Wednesday, I thought, you know what, I want to talk about this in a video. And I thought, you know what, it'd be absolutely, absolutely funny and hilarious. I was actually telling a close friend a few days ago and she thought it was absolutely funny, so she did. So I thought, you know what, I want to talk about it and I hope you all get a good kick out of it as well. Um, hope it makes you laugh and everything, so yeah. So this story is about a, about a time when my mother cut my hair and overall it did not go well, <laughs> so it didn't. So this was back in 2006 and at this point I was 11 years old, <laughs> so I was. And around the time my hair was starting to get a lot longer, <laughs> so I was. And my mother thought, uh, instead of going over to the barbers, <laughs> why don't I cut it? You know, she can save a little bit more, a little bit of money and stuff, and it'd be a lot easier and stuff. And I was a little bit weary. I wasn't really confident about that uh, because my mother had never cut my hair before, <laughs> so she hadn't. Uh, but I thought, yeah, she, if she wants to do it, <laughs> you know, she can. But I was a little bit questionable about it. So <laughs> my mum starts cutting my hair as usual. Nothing going wrong. And unfortunately, while she's cutting it and stuff, it literally gets stuck on my hair. So it does, literally stuck on my hair around here. I remember being so scared. I remember starting crying. I remember, you know, being so worried. And I remember, I remember my mum was like in shock. She was like, oh my God, you know what I mean? Because <clears throat> she thought she uh, made me bleed. <laughs> so she did. So, so she did. But she didn't. She just, you know scared about it and it was mainly because of the fact she forgot to put the guard on the hair clippers so yeah so what ended up happening was remember my mum got so upset she literally put my baseball cap on me uh literally ran me over to the hair uh, to the barbers <coughs> waited until i got you know served until they cut my hair and my mum felt so sorry <coughs> so she did i remember she gave me um uh, she gave me a good amount of money so she did like a little bit of money obviously uh, for me to buy some football stickers, you know, and the annuals that they do every World Cup and every Euros. Um, she somewhat, like, paid me off <laughs> um, so she, so I could buy some football stickers, sort of, to calm me down. And I was happy about that, but I remember I, still, I was still in shock when, when that happened and stuff. And it, um, it, it, it did hurt. It really, really did. And it took many years um, for me to fully trust my mum cutting my hair. Now, I've not been to a barber's in about six years, so I haven't. Um, I stopped going because my mum actually just thought it'd be easy to get a, a pair of hair clippers instead. And I remember when she actually did that around like 2014, 2015, I was still a bit questionable, so I was. But I thought, I'll see how she goes. And she did quite well with it. You know, she cut it quite well and everything. And... Um, perfect you know it looked good to me and it looked good to her <clears throat> so I did and after that point she's always cut my hair so she has and um yeah like I said you know she's got a lot better over, over the years of, of cutting it so so she has and I remember when she started doing it again I remember I always said one thing that always made her laugh it always made me laugh and that was 2006 because she knew what that meant so she did <laughs> <laughs> yeah, um, but yeah, I wanted to talk about this and stuff because I find it funny and hilarious and stuff. And I thought, you know what? I like to make these little, you know, funny stories. I know I did one quite a while ago, um, that time when I asked that woman out uh, last year. But I thought, you know what? I want to talk about a funny little story that happened many, many years ago. So, yeah. So I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you found it uh, funny and, and entertaining and stuff. Uh, I just want to say thanks for watching all. Enjoy the rest of your weekend and I'll see you all on Tuesday. Thanks for watching all. It's great to be back. Bye.